Alright, so honestly, I was really hoping that by now we would have seen the details for the upcoming LR Android 17 and 18 Extreme Z Awakening, but unfortunately, that is still yet to be revealed. But on the bright side, we still did get some Android EZA details in the form of the AGL Trench Coat 17 and the Int Hellfighter 17. So, Without further ado, let's uh, jump right into it. Both of them are very, very good. And starting with the Android 17, let's talk about his pre-EZA details first and then go over the Extreme Z Awakened details for comparison purposes. So starting with his leader skill, it was AGL and Int Types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 30%, super attack supreme damage and greatly lowers defense, and passive AGL and Int Types key plus 2, Attack and defense plus 25%. Now with the Extreme Z Awakening, his new leader skill is AGL and int types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 90%. Super attack raises attack and defense for one turn, causes supreme damage, and greatly lowers defense. And passive is attack and defense plus 120%, attack plus 120% when performing a super attack. All allies key plus 2 and attack and defense plus 25% plus an additional defense plus 170% when your team has an ally whose name includes number 17 attacking in the same turn. And uh, as far as his stats go, after the Extreme Z Awakening, they max out at 17,450 HP, 15,993 attack, and 10,880 defense. So that is the uh, Trench Coat 17. Now moving on to... The Hellfighter 17 before the Extreme Z Awakening leader skill is Int Types and Fizz Types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 30%, super attack, supreme damage with a rare chance to stun the enemy, and passive was attack plus 90% and key plus 2 when facing only one enemy. Now with the Extreme Z Awakening leader skill is Int Types and Fizz Types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 90%, super attack raises attack and defense for one turn and causes supreme damage with a medium chance of stunning the enemy, and passive is attack and defense plus 120%, defense plus 120% when performing a super attack, all allies key plus 2, attack and defense plus 25%, plus an additional attack plus 170% when your team has an ally whose name includes number 17 attacking in the same turn, and his stats are... Uh, 17,032 HP, 16,197 attack, and 10,541 defense at rainbow status after the Extreme Z Awakening. So in my mind, I'm thinking these two are going to make an absolutely insane rotation, guys. I mean, first of all, they give each other that extra boost because they both have number 17 in their names, but they're both also support units, so in total... Uh, they're giving key plus 4 and attack and defense plus 50% to the entire rotation, right? And uh, this guy's going to be getting a ton of attack when he's supering, all while also getting good defense. And then this guy's going to be getting a ton of defense while also still getting good attack. So, um, yeah, they're just going to be a really, really good rotation for each other. Obviously, you can use them with other androids and it's still going to be good but like clearly these guys are meant to be run together and uh, it's going to be a really crazy rotation with them supporting each other with them giving each other their full passives and uh, the stats are pretty good too obviously not dokkan fest level stats but still like you know the other guy has close to 16,000 attack this guy has over 16,000 attack and both of them have around 11,000 defense so they're both going to be quite tanky especially uh, this dude right here and we should be seeing some pretty crazy damage numbers from this guy so I'm excited I'm excited to run this rotation I'm especially excited to find out what this Extreme Z Awakening is going to look like but I'm sure we won't have to wait too long because they're literally coming out in like a day and a half I think so uh, within the next 24 hours we'll find out exactly what the LR 17 and 18's Extreme Z Awakening looks like. But for now, there's the Trenchcoat 17 and Hellfighter 17, two extremely impressive Extreme Z Awakenings on the way. 
And uh, that's it, guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about them. Are you as impressed as I am? Or do you think they're just okay? Either way, that's going to be a video. That's going to be the video. Thank you so much for watching, as always. If you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.